WTFNN. Headline News Update. Good afternoon, folks. This is Steve Rhodes coming to you live from sunny Delray Beach, Florida. This is your 1 p.m. update. And currently, we've got all the indices trading to the upside. Let's go take a look at them out here. Let's get my uh, screen going. And you've got the Dow trading up 162 points, S&P 30, NASDAQ 100 up 1 to 3 tenths percent, 150 points. Russell's up uh, 13 points. So let's take a look at what we want to be watching uh, during the day out here. Now, at this stage of the game, uh, we've got some short term uh, topping patterns are in place. So expect the markets to kind of move sideways, potentially even uh, have to make a, a short term top out here. But with regard to the larger picture, we've got that spot volatility trading below its 50 day exponential moving average. That exponential moving average is 2682. Spot volatility trading down to 2525. Pretty good odds that the spot volatility is headed down to 2273. If it in fact does head lower, the S&P 500 will move sideways to higher. Well, if we take a look at the ES Mini, that's in the right-hand panel out here. We'll see that price yesterday closed above the top of its weekly profile. Today is going to be above the top of that weekly profile. That is all suggesting that the S&P 500 wants to continue to move higher. If we take a look at the ES Mini and just stick with it, it's got an A to B equals CD pattern. Now, the one-to-one -one price projection gets us up to 34.90. We're at 34.68 right now. Odds favor that while the spot volatility makes its way down to that lower Bollinger Band reading that uh, we'll see price in the ES Mini make it between 34.90 to 35.41 before uh, it generates its next uh uh, sell pattern that would be the Gartley uh, sell out there if we take a look at the NQ the NQ out here right now uh, this is trading above the uh, swing point from back on the trading day of uh, this is the B point of a potential A to B equals CD to the upside that was resistance that was October 2nd that was a bearish engulfing candle uh, so that says the high of the candles that engulf would be resistance prices above that so there may be an A to B equals CD pattern uh, going on inside the NQ uh, volume is light as taken out that uh, B point with light volume. So this could be a tiger Gartley pattern that is setting up out here. Now, the interesting thing, I mentioned that the uh, we may see the market stall out here. If we take a look at the NQ, that's been the strongest today out here. The level to be watching. This is going to be a sign for the rest of the day. There's a TD nine count pattern that is in effect. And if price closes above 11,687, we're at 11,695 right now. This will be a close at 130. If there's a close above 11,687, you should expect and anticipate a further rally into the close today because that would be a strong momentum move.